6. Mildly interesting facts about tape. Fact number 1. Richard Drew was an employee at 3M, a company that produces a wide range of products, including adhesives, abrasives, and laminates. In 1930, Drew developed a clear, pressure-sensitive tape that was initially used for sealing cellophane wrappers. This tape, which was called Scotch Tape, became a popular and widely used product for sealing and repairing a variety of items. The development of Scotch Tape marked an important milestone in the history of adhesive tapes, as it was one of the first clear pressure-sensitive tapes to be widely available on the market. Prior to the invention of Scotch Tape, adhesives were often difficult to apply and remove, and they often left a noticeable residue on surfaces. Scotch Tape, on the other hand, was easy to use and could be easily removed without leaving any residue. This made it a popular choice for a wide range of applications, including packaging, sealing envelopes, and attaching items together. Today, Scotch Tape is a household name and is sold in a variety of sizes and formats. Fact number 2. One interesting story involving the use of Scotch Tape took place in 2004, when a group of scientists used scotch tape to discover a new type of material called graphene. Graphene is a two-dimensional material made of carbon atoms that is known for its exceptional strength and electrical conductivity. It has a wide range of potential applications, including in electronics, energy storage, and materials science. The scientists, who later went on to win the Nobel Prize, were attempting to study the properties of graphene when they made an unexpected discovery. They were using scotch tape to peel off layers of graphene from a sample of graphite, a common form of carbon, when they noticed that the tape was picking up thin layers of graphene that were not visible to the naked eye. Upon closer examination, the scientists discovered that the tape had picked up small triangular flakes of graphene that had previously been overlooked. These flakes, which the scientists named scotch tape graphene, were found to have unique properties that differed from those of conventional graphene. This discovery was made possible by the use of scotch tape, which proved to be an effective tool for separating and studying the small flakes of graphene. The discovery of scotch tape graphene has led to further research and development in the field of graphene and has opened up new possibilities for its use in a variety of applications. Fact number 3. Masking tape is a type of pressure-sensitive adhesive tape that's specifically designed for use in painting and labeling applications. It was developed by 3M in the 1920s and has become a popular and widely used product for a variety of purposes. Masking tape is typically made from a thin flexible backing material that is coated with a low adhesion adhesive. The backing material is often made from crepe paper which gives the tape its characteristic conformability and flexibility. The adhesive is designed to have a low adhesion level, so it can be easily removed from surfaces without leaving any residue or causing damage. Masking tape is commonly used to mask off areas that shouldn't be painted, such as trim, windows, and doorways. Masking tape is a simple, yet essential addition to any painter and decorator's toolbox. It's also heavily relied upon in automotive body shops. Fact number 4. Magnetic tape is a thin, plastic tape that's coated with a layer of magnetic material, and it's used for storing data by encoding it onto the magnetic surface of the tape. The magnetic tape was developed in the 1930s by Fritz Flumer, a German engineer and inventor. Flumer's development of magnetic tape was an important innovation in the field of data storage, and it revolutionized the way that data was recorded and stored. Prior to the development of magnetic tape, data was typically recorded onto phonograph records or punch cards, which were limited in their storage capacity and weren't very durable. Flumer's magnetic tape was designed to be used with a special machine called a magnetic tape recorder. The magnetic tape recorder was able to encode data onto the magnetic tape and play it back, making it a convenient and efficient way to store and retrieve data. Magnetic tape has been widely used for a variety of purposes since its development, including recording and storing audio, video, and computer data. Magnetic tape has played a significant role in the development of modern computing and has been an important tool in a variety of industries and applications. Fact number 5. Duct tape, also known as duct tape, 
is a type of strong, durable adhesive tape that is known for its versatility and holding power. It was originally developed during World War II for sealing ammunition cases, as it was able to withstand extreme temperature changes and resist water and other elements. After the war, duct tape was used for repairing military equipment and eventually found its way into everyday use as a versatile repair tape. It's made from a strong, waterproof backing material that's coated with a rubber-based adhesive. The backing material is typically made from a blend of polyethylene and cotton or polyester fibers, which gives it strength and durability. Duct tape is known for its strong holding power and is used for a variety of repair tasks. It's commonly used to seal and repair pipes, seal air ducts, and fix leaks. Duct tape is also used in camping and outdoor activities for repairing gear and equipment. Overall, duct tape is a strong and versatile adhesive tape that is widely used throughout the world. Fact number 6. The story of the duct tape repair on Apollo 13 is one of the most famous examples of the versatility and effectiveness of duct tape. The mission of Apollo 13 was to land on the moon, but it was disrupted by a malfunction that caused an explosion in one of the spacecraft's oxygen tanks. The explosion caused the loss of one of the spacecraft's two oxygen tanks and caused damage to the other tank and the spacecraft's electrical system. The astronauts, Jim Lovell, Jack Swaggart, and Fred Hayes, were forced to abandon their plans to land on the moon and instead focused on returning to Earth. To survive the journey home, the astronauts had to use their resourcefulness and ingenuity to improvise solutions to the problems they faced. One of the most famous examples of this was the use of duct tape to repair a carbon dioxide filter, this repair was critical to their survival. To fix the problem, the astronauts used duct tape to hold the filter in place and to seal the connections between the filter and the air system. The improvised repair was a success, and it allowed the astronauts to continue their journey home. The story of the duct tape repair on Apollo 13 is a testament to the versatility and effectiveness of duct tape and it serves as an example of the resourcefulness and ingenuity of the astronauts in the face of a life-threatening situation.